The Cleveland Metro Parks are a gold medal park district. What does that mean? We we're going to welcome Debbie Berry and David Whitehead. They can explain it all. How are you today? We are fantastic. Doing Thanks well, for having Jimmy. us. We all right. appreciate it. So what's a gold, what's a gold medal district? What does that mean? Well, the Cleveland Metro Parks is celebrating its 100 year centennial this okay. year, and we were just honored by being the best park district in the nation with a gold medal. But it's not an honor just for us, the Metro Parks. It's really an honor for the entire community and all the staff and everyone that volunteers and works in the Metro Parks. Our, our Metro Parks, like I grew up in the Cleveland School District, I used to get the Emerald Necklace, a little publication and yes. all that kind of stuff. Our Metro Parks is one of the things that I, a lot of people take for granted. If we went to some other city and saw this, we go, oh my God, you wouldn't believe what they have. And so we have it, and it is amazing. We, we I do. think I think uh, the emerald necklace is unique to this region and people from around the country when they come here they're amazed that we have something that basically rings the entire area and uh, it's just a gift that we've been blessed with and we maintain. And I don't think people understand either the economic impact that the Metro Parks has in this area. They think it's just a, it's some trees and some grass over there, but it, it helps <laughs> us economically too. It's a significant impact on the community. We had a study done in 2013 by the Trust for Public Land, over $855 million invested in the community as a result of the Metro Parks themselves. So it's a huge benefit to both Cuyahoga County and Hinckley Township. So what are we gonna do? What, how are we gonna celebrate this 100 year in the gold medal? What are we gonna do special? We've got a number of activities planned. Um, we just made an announcement this week about a partnership with Key Bank where we're bringing back the fireworks to Edgewater Park on July 22nd. Oh, that'll be awesome. That's going to be a fabulous activity. And then in the next month or so, we'll be reintroducing the zoo keys back to the Okay, now I'm, we're zoo. just going to stop. Okay. I am not going to allow though. <laughs> when I was growing up, <laughs> we had enough money to get into the zoo, and that was it. And I'd see the other kids, the rich kids with their little zoo keys, oh. get all sorts of information <laughs> that I couldn't get. I'm going, I'm going to buy zoo keys for everybody Get now. a zoo key. Okay. <laughs> Wonderful. We heard you say that, so we'll remember it. Thank that, you. That was such a neat thing. You, you put the key in there, and somebody will tell you a little Absolutely. bit about the rhinoceros they'll tell you about the different like animals and their right. history. And, right. and, what, and people, don't, they may not understand the connection between the zoo and the Cleveland Metro Park, so it's, it's, that, that's all intertwined. A long history there, the, the zoo was the city of Cleveland Zoo at one point, and the Metro Parks took it over many, many years ago, and it's a staple. Again, another award, award winning zoo uh, in terms of its national recognition, and uh, we're just very proud of the, all that they have accomplished over the years. Wolf Wilderness and things like that, where kids can come in for camping and so forth. It's just a special place. That's a special place, and we had the what the new Tiger Passage. The Roseboro Tiger Passage yeah, right opened up sweet. last year, and then the elephants a few years before that. And so we've got some new things coming down the pipeline. So right. there'll be new announcements. And I just needed a better escalator to get me because sometimes I'm getting old. I can't get up there. <laughs> There's a tram available for you, so I it's feel, good for I, you to walk. I want to be able to pretend get your like recreation I'm <laughs> out uh, in our park system. Wherever well, I should get out and celebrate the hundredth year. Hundredth year, big and year. then any, anything else special going into the next 100 years? There'll be a number of activities throughout the year this year. Okay. You'll hear more as we're rolling things out okay. continuously. And yeah. they can probably go to the website and get information. You Absolutely. gotta talk about the book here real quick. That's, uh... Sure, we put out a special centennial book this year, 1917 to 2017, our 100 year celebration. And it's really fantastic. It was actually all done in house, um, written and put together by our own staff. And so it's available at uh, our kiosks and And you and online. David took the pictures? We, <laughs> 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 we just blessed it. All right. Some even precede us. All right. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks Thank for having you. us.